hello you guys welcome back to my channel and today is not a makeup tutorial today is a vlog of what i'm going to be doing for the next couple of days so basically this vlog is going to be a collective of um the next few days that are coming up i decided that instead of me just doing you know the normal sit down talking videos where i'm just talking to you guys and doing my makeup i wanted to include a little bit of you know what i do on a personal level and you know just so you can get to know me and feel a little bit more personal with me besides you know the standard sit down and talking video so with that being said this vlog that you're gonna see is gonna be a collective of the next few days coming up um i don't have anything like major planned i am going to be um going to look for a dress to wear to an event this month and it's an event with a with uh my husband and myself our company is having a event that they do every single year so i need to find something to wear and um oh yeah also i did forget uh there's a galantine event coming up at my in-laws um boutique that she works at they are having like a 15 percent off sale so with that being said i will record that However, today I don't have anything in particular planned. I just wanted to have something to start off this vlog with. So the only thing I'm about to do right now is I'm about to head out and probably in like an hour and a half. So with that being said, I might record me and Brianna's workout tonight because we are working out. Um, if you don't know who that is, I will have her name on the screen because she has a YouTube channel as well. So you should check her out. But yeah, I'm going to, I'll probably like record a little bit of us working out, um, depending on how packed it is in the gym. But other than that, I don't have anything else to say what's up you guys it is another day and i just finished filming this makeup look so if you are watching this before you saw the makeup look it should already be on my channel before this vlog goes up so yeah i really really like this look and huh, i just finished cleaning up like my space from when I was filming, I still have my ring light on because it's getting dark outside and just the light from this room is terrible. So yeah, um, this is the infamous background you guys see in my video. And as you can see, I have changed up my background. I don't have my printer up here anymore. I decided I wanted to take it off because I wanted my computer to be in the center. And then I just placed some pieces that I already had just laying around in the closet that I wasn't using anymore. We had these in our like old apartments. So, and then the chaos in front of me. And if you just heard that noise, I promise I did not fart. <laughs> that was my chair. But um, I put on my makeup up and now I have all these brushes I need to wash and i just have stuff everywhere that i need to clean up um i cannot wait until i order my makeup desk so that i can have some space and i can hide all of these things that i have accumulating on top of this one little desk so yeah that's all i have going on right now i'm just waiting on my husband to come back home he wants to go visit his cousin and figure out what we're gonna have for dinner tonight so let me introduce y'all to my little baby. Harley, come say hello to the people. Come here. Say hi, people. Say hi. Don't worry, guys. She's gonna get groomed this week. Say hi to the people. Oh. 
And right now she's all stinky and stuff and straggly, but we're gonna get that taken care of this week. So I just kind of wanted to pop in and say hello and I'll see you guys either tomorrow or whenever I start vlogging again for my vlog that I'm going to be putting up. So I'll see you guys later. Bye. What's up you guys? Today is Thursday and this will be another part in my vlog. So right now I'm just getting dressed, getting ready. So this is not like a makeup tutorial where I'm talking to you guys and telling you what I'm doing. You may hear some noise in the background, but this is just something I wanted to include in the vlog as well. So basically you're just gonna go and get ready with me. So I went to Target today. Oh, by the way, y'all, I got my nails done. And I picked up some lashes. So I'm super duper excited to try these. And I picked up some new lash glue as well. So I don't have a lot of time to get ready, but I'm gonna try to do something very quick and easy. So I have these Ardell Naked Lashes and I have the number 422 and 421. That's what they look like. So yeah, one is a little bit more fuller and then the other ones are kind of like sparse a little bit. So like I said, this is not a standard makeup tutorial. So I'm just gonna like go through and do my makeup as normal. I wish I could listen to some music right now, but I can't turn my Google on because my husband is trying to take a nap before he has to go to work. And I don't feel like turning my computer on. What's up everybody today is monday um i think it's the 17th and today 
I will be meeting up with Brianna at the mall today. Um, the original plan was to find me something to wear for this convention that we had coming up, but I don't think I need to find anything to wear anymore. I um, went through my clothes at home and found a dress that I wore once, maybe like a couple of years ago for my birthday. And the reason why I was looking for a dress was because um, they do themes for these conventions. And I'm not even sure if it's really called a convention, but whatever it is, um, they usually have themes. And last year when we went, I believe the theme was, um, uh, I have no idea. So I guess scratch that. Whatever the thing was last year, me and my husband kind of went with the theme. Like, I think it was like a royal type of theme. I don't know. But we went with the theme or whatever and like dressed up because, um, you know, it was saying like you should dress up and uh, everybody would be wearing like gowns and stuff like that. And I was like, um, I don't know if I'm gonna go all out and get a gown, but I can get something that's close enough to a gown. And I found something in, I believe it was Macy's. And when we got there, nobody was like really dressed for the occasion, basically. So this year, the theme is supposed to be like Hollywood glam or something like that. And I was gonna wear something, you know, gold and black or probably just black, but the way it's looking, I'm probably gonna, wear that dress that I have at home it's not really on the theme but because last year nobody really participated I'm not really pressed to find something in the mall for this event but if I uh, do happen to come across something and it's not breaking the bank then maybe I'll um, pick it up and you know I'll have something then but since that was the original plan why we really truly came to the mall um now we're just basically here to browse around see what we can see and see what we can find and i'm definitely going to be hitting up sephora because i have ran out of my set and spray in both my travel size my full size and i even had a sample size one that i found and i ran out of it this morning so i really need to re-up on my set and spray because i can't live without it um so yeah i'm just waiting on her um to get here now and when she gets here i'll probably vlog just a little bit of us going into the mall and you know whatever store we get into first and please keep in mind that this is new for me and vlogging in public like this is new for the both of us so i'm gonna try my best to get as much footage as i can um, even though I honestly don't know anybody here where I live um, besides family and like close, close, close friends that I met through my husband's family, but it's still kind of weird, I guess. And I, I want to get used to it. So, you know, just bear with me with the footage that I get and hopefully I do get some great content for you. And also we're going to have like a little lunch date because we... You know, just want to have some girl time. She's basically like my little sister slash best friend slash in-law. So, yeah, like we like to get our girl time in whenever we can and spend some time with each other when it's not with just our family and our significant others. You know, just want to do something just one on one. So, yeah, when she get here, I will pick back up where I left off at. Say what's up? Hello. I told him how you're a bad influence on me. First of and all. And we shouldn't shop together. We shouldn't, but I'm broke, so. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna tell myself. <laughs> All right, you got a lot of yourself so you won't overspend.
Well, mall trip was whew, a bummer. See nothing. Well, we did we get... get a little bit of something, <laughs> but that's it. Yeah, nothing. After seeing nothing, I still worked up an appetite. Right. <laughs> Is it too early for one to agree? No. That's exactly what we're gonna go get <laughs> and have a some great bread knots. Yes. And then go to the gym. Right later. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, my God. Sky. <laughs> <laughs> I am shook it. Literally. Bless it. Well, oh. Yeah, I did a horrible job of vlogging in the mall. <laughs> I did vlog a little bit in H and M, but that was it. And showed me trying on my stuff. Still didn't see anything. Nothing. What's up everybody it is now seven o'clock at night and I had to make a little detour I had to make a stop so today was kind of a fail with vlogging a little bit I did get like a few pieces here and there but like I said I'm new to this so you know just bear with me um you know hopefully I'll get better at this I just came from Target. The reason why I'm looking around is I'm just checking my surroundings because it's dark outside. But I just left from Target and we are, well, I had to make a detour and Brianna went to go pick something up. But we will be working out after I'm finished where I'm at and we're going to meet up at the gym and get a workout in because these bodies ain't gonna make themselves so um like i said seven o'clock um whenever i get down where i'm at i will probably vlog a little bit of us at the gym if it's not too crowded in there
So guys, I am back home for the day. It is pretty late. I just got back in from the gym and I decided to come and sit on the corner of my couch because I just wanted to show you guys a little bit of what I got. Um, I am tired, my legs are hurting. So like I said, we went to the mall and it was kind of a fail, even though I didn't have anything in particular that I wanted to go and buy. However, um, I did get a little bit of something. So I'm gonna just show you guys briefly what I got. So first up, I went to Aerie. And if you hear some noise in the background, it's my dog. So at Aerie, they had their underwear 10 for 35, I believe. So I got some new underwear. I'm not gonna show that. She's gonna get real extra cause I'm home. And then I got a pair of leggings that look like this. They have like the pockets on the side. And these are their chill play and move feel cozy light support um, leggings. And I have another pair of their leggings. They are like a dark gray color and they have like a little drawstring, which I honestly don't think it does anything. But I wanted to get a pair of these because if I'm being honest, I don't think I've owned a pair of black leggings for like a couple of years now. Never just been interested in getting any until now because sometimes I want to be comfortable. And then I have I got a pair of these bike shorts. And this is what they look like. They were at first I was skeptical about this part in the front, but when I tried it on, it actually looked pretty cute. So that's what I got from Airy. Those two items and then the underwear. Next up we have Sephora. So I have been on a hunt for some skincare products to become like a staple for me and to have like a consistent skincare regimen. Every now and then I don't mind trying something new, but I just wanted to have something that is very consistent for me. So, first of all, before I even get into the skincare, your girl got her another Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. Um, very much needed. And I picked up this Olay. Hold on, let me check something real quick. Cause it looked like somebody opened it. like I was saying, your girl got this Ole Henriksen face wash. This is the Find Your Balance Oil Control Cleanser. Um, I do get very oily in my T-zone, like extremely oily. So I picked up their Ole Henriksen um, toner in the same package color as well because the green packaging is catered to oil control. So I have the toner and now I have the face wash. However, I don't plan on using, cause I don't use the toner every single day. So my plan is to maybe use this along with the toner maybe twice a week because I don't want to pull out too much of my oils because I need, you need some of them. So I got that and then I got this other Ole Henriksen product. This is what it looks like. And this is the Invigorating Night Transformation Gel. So basically this evens uh, your tone, evens your skin tone and texture. So I have the toner as well for the um, blue packaging because the blue packaging caters to dark spots. So now I have the nighttime gel and the dark spot uh, toner. And I use the dark spot toner. That's just her way of showing she's excited that someone is home. But it's so funny. So like I was saying, 
uh i use the blue toner at night time i don't use that toner no i do use that toner every single night or i try to use it every single night so um let's see okay so the directions said apply evenly to clean face and neck nightly and allow to absorb so basically i'm gonna be trying this and seeing how it works and last but not least i got the travel size or the i guess you would call it the travel size the first soy face cleanser you guys this is what it looks like i got the larger size it's in my shower right now and when i seen this up front i was like uh yeah i need to get that so i can take this to travel with um i really 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 like this face wash for not only taking off my makeup because that's usually what i hear a lot of people use it for to take out their makeup and it melts it away but this product it also helps when like you have a long day and you just want to remove the oil and dirt and gunk from your face this is what i go in with first in my shower and then i go in with another face wash whatever i'm feeling for today but this stuff right here is really really good i really do recommend it it's really really good so that's all i got from sephora then i went to tj maxx and my goal for tj maxx was to find a new gym bag because the one i currently have i don't know i just don't want it no more i'm over it i want a new one but it looks like it's not gonna work so i'm just gonna keep it until one day a gym bag jumps out at me and says buy me okay so i am in desperate need of sports bras like that's just something that i don't look for when i buy workout clothes which is very weird i will find the bottoms and the tops but i don't get the sports bras so i got two sports bras and this is a new balance sports bra and i got a a darker gray one so i got a black one and a gray one i however i have the gray one on so i can't show it to you guys right now because i did go work out today and then i just purchased some new succulents and I need to change the pots for two of them. However, I only was able to find one for one of my plants. And this is what it looks like. Just plain white and this was $6. So that's all I got from TJ Maxx. And then the last store that I went to was Target. Um, Pretty much in Target, I got some more cotton pads and the main, oh, and then I got some more of the simple micellar cleansing water. Y'all, if you have oily skin, this is the way to go. I've been using my little travel size one that I bought. Look, I've been running out of all my products, as you can see, because I've been going in with my travel size stuff so i had to go and stock up on another one of these um micellar waters but if you have oily skin i highly 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 recommend using this particular brand i have the wipe uh makeup wipe removers as well from this same exact brand when i take off my makeup instead of like getting oily and just feeling like I wiped off my makeup, but now I still feel dirty because the oil from the makeup remover is now in my skin. This right here does not do that, so I promise. Um, then I came across this cute little cozy sports bra thing. So, I'm assuming you can use it to work out in if you want to, but this was in the cozy section in Target. And I have the night set. So it's like a two piece and it came with a shirt and the shorts. But I also wanted to try, you know, one of the little sports bras as well. 
they just never had my size whenever I go in there or they always had like large left or extra small left and that's not the tea for me. And then lastly, I got some more of those Ardell Naked Lashes that I showed you guys. And this is in the 422 style. I really love this uh, style of lashes right here. So you guys, that is all that I got today. And even though it was a fail because I was expecting to buy like clothes, like some shirts and you know, some cute little two pieces, but I didn't find none of that. Like I walked in the mall very disappointed when I left back out. So I don't know if this is gonna be the end of the vlog, but I do hope you guys enjoyed the little bit that I was able to capture for you guys. Like I said, this is my very first time vlogging. So, you know, I just have to get used to it and, you know, give me some time to warm up to recording in public. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed the little bits and pieces that I am sharing, I shared with you guys. And if you haven't already, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on that notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a video. You guys, I am so tired. So I'm sorry if I'm stumbling over my words and repeating myself, but yeah, that's it for this vlog. I am about to go eat my food, take a shower, and get in the bed because I have to get up early in the morning. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye.